The guys have done a wonderful job so far talking and it's my job to say thank you to everybody. So I did it in a little roundabout way, so bear with me. A word of thanks to my darling wife and later I will speak of how she changed my life. But first I must thank the people I see. Without all of you, this day wouldn't be. For the people who've traveled from far and from wide, Australia, the States, and even Dubai. People have traveled from here and beyond, a good few more from across the pond. To the priests and the servers, and my cousins, the choir, up on the altar, my heart was on fire. My heart was a flutter before you did sing as I waited for Katie and the church bells to ring. So on the day that we both said I do, this is a thank you to all of you. Now is the time to tell you a tale of a night down in Nina, I was out on the ale. When I met a wee girl at the start of the night, the feeling was different, it just felt so right. We laughed and we danced and we had so much fun. I knew then and there that she was the one. So from there we set off on a long distance thing and I knew that it wasn't just a holiday fling. When three years had passed and you took a chance moving to Oz to follow romance. And it was then and there that shit it got real. In love more each day you'd make me feel. Five years have passed and not a day that goes by that I think to myself how lucky am I. I don't think you know how much you have done. For me I feel that I've already won. But this is just the start of a new chapter in life, our very first day as husband and wife. And with a quote, I will finish my story so, Shane McGowan spoke of a night in Soho. And Paddy, our, our, our MC, he's our celebrity hack, even managed to get him up off his back. But things are not always as they seem. But Katie, my love, you truly are the measure of dreams. The rest of our lives.